This video is sponsored by Win Win Technology, your ultimate flight sim hardware solution. Featuring the Orion whole test, current and future configurations. Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing very well. Today, another pinch of history with a little twist for you. Bean, what's going on today? Hi Cap, so as viewers might remember, we've already done the first uh, Taiwan State Crisis and the second Taiwan Strait Crisis. Um, so today uh, we're going to do the third Taiwan Strait Crisis. So if you cast your minds back to 1996, um, a young Cap had probably just bought his first Spice Girls album. Mm -hmm. um, Bill Clinton was uh, president coming towards the end of his first term. Um, and uh, effectively a diplomatic spat kicked off between um, uh, the, the Chinese mainland and, and the Republic of China, which is Taiwan. Um, and this was because the president of Taiwan was invited to go and talk in the US and it was seen as a recognition of Taiwanese independence by China. So things started to, to escalate. Um, in response, um, uh, uh, President Clinton sent in a, a task force as a show of force. Um, and that included the uh, USS Nimitz independence um, and the Marine Corps as well. Uh, with their carrier, uh, the, the Bellu Wood, apologies if I pronounced that wrong. Um, and uh, in the real world, what happened was uh, there was this threat of amphibious assault drills and uh, missile tests that carried on, um, but, um, but that was it. it, it never escalated any further. But for tonight, we're going to uh, pretend that actually um, the Communist Chinese forces go the whole hog and they invade one of the islands, uh, one of the islands near their coast. So, um, quite a complicated mission um, and uh, I don't know, it's probably best if I start going through the tabs uh, one by one, if that's okay with you, Cap. Okay, so similar to the previous missions, we've got these amphibious invasion forces, um, but this time, of course, they're supported by uh, some naval assets, some frigates. So if you have a look at the naval intel tab, you'll see, again, we have these um, uh, sort of World War II vintage LSTs uh, and landing craft um, and uh, some, unfortunately we don't have T-64s, so we've got T-55s um, sort of subbing in, some APCs, they will all be landing on the beach on the north coast there. Um, so yeah, people need a World War II asset pack if they haven't already realized that. Uh, and then we have these three frigates, which are providing a bit of a sand bubble over the area um, and should therefore be disabled. They're not necessarily sunk, but disabled. Um, we did a bit of testing on this last week and we decided to scale back that sand bubble a bit. So, you know, you have to get relatively close before they'll shoot you down. Um, for the air intel, uh, I mean, this is the Chinese Air Force, um, gosh, more than 20 years ago, now 25 years ago, which makes me feel very old. Um, and, it, and it's amazing to see the difference. Um, you know, they mostly had MiG-21s, which is the J-7, is the domestic variant, and MiG-19s, which is the J-6. Um, and uh, we don't have necessarily all the airframes in DCS, so we've got this Su-24 subbing in as a as a Z and JH seven, which um, have the capability to carry anti ship missiles, and I think it's you know safe to assume that if they had a, a Nimitz carrier group steaming through the area, threatening to do an amphibious assault, um, a counter assault, they'd probably send out a flight of these. So um, particularly our F-14s should keep their eyes peeled for, for those aircraft. Um, for Grav, it's quite involved as well. There's two Grav forces. The Marines have already come ashore. Uh, on the island um, and established a, a forward operating base. Uh, so we've got K-50s and gazelles subbing in for um, Cobras uh, operating from the FOB. Uh, their job is to go and, and, and pick off some of the armor um, and the gazelles will provide a bit of a, a, a mistral um, air, air, air support cap for them. Although, you know, really we're relying on the fixed wing cap to do most of that work. Um, for the transport helos, it's a little bit more complicated. Uh, you've actually got to take off from um, the uh, Tarawa and, well, the Beaulieu Wood is, is here, uh, and proceed to the landing zone in the photo there. Uh, drop off your troops. It'll be accessible through a radio menu. So make sure you go um, to your comms menu as normal, and then um, you'll see under F10, uh, I think it is to go to more options. You'll see the option to drop your troops off. Once you've done that, there's some crates uh, just uh, on the outside of the ring of tires that are marking that LZ. Um, those crates, uh, they are to be sling loaded. They can't be internally loaded. They have to be sling loaded north to a, um, a landing zone where we will build a, a, a Hawk Sam. Um, so yeah, that's kind of everything from me. Happy to hand back to you cap to go through the flights and take any questions roger flights first the chinese no one's in the j6 it's the j7 fish cans we have sandy jigsaw red 
Dabber and cover is on standby. Oh, on the blue side, the goodies. We have Springfield, which are the Tomcats. Sock with Luke and cover as well. And Dodge, or Bogs, anti ship slash cap. Blood, Jacal, Grump, Ali, B, and Stoat. Colt, ooh, what was that? Colt, anti ship. Space Chef, cap, chopsticks, shugs. Jarhead. Uh, Harriers today. Mookie, Makabu, Cobra. Uh, the Cobra Standings, the Camovs, Pineapple Shrek Bree, Uzi. Cobras again. Gazelle standing in. Artie Bean, Unexpected Brinks. Stallion, the CH53C Stallions, MI8 standing in. Tuxor, Pimpaho, Iroquois, Empty. Enfield. Some more bogs. Interesting. Doing cap. Obi, Penguin, Simon. Isn't it, isn't it amazing how in 25 years, I suppose it's quite a long time, but isn't it amazing they've gone from having a bunch of 50-year-old fish beds and MiG-19s, 50, 60 years old, well, not yeah, nearly as long as that at the time, actually, maybe 40 years old, to having well, basically the most advanced fighters in the world, the J-20 stealth fighter, the J-16, the 15, the 11, J-10, it's, uh, it's been a big turnaround in, you know, kind of 20 years, isn't it? I'm just spectating. There's a bunch of harpoons out already going towards the Chinese. Don't know who fired them. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, so that's the, what, the very shooting? Maybe it's going to have more luck than us with the harpoon bees. We'll see. Order. I'm going to take some silly weapons, this is some fun. Okay, bad news is YJ-83s are out from the Chinese on their way to us. That's the bad news. They so copied this. Well, it's very low, doesn't it, Valley Viewers? What, what, what happens when it goes through these trees? And what would happen if it went through real trees? Would it get hurt? Would it just push through? Ah! Went straight through them. Ah! Uh, oh, look at that! Wow, that made me jump. Good news, guys, good news. All of the YG-83s just got blown up. They all hit trees. It looks like ours are about to do the same, but the power of trees in DCS. See, told you I love Greta. The idea is that we're going to attack from the southeast. Our IP is going to be Krimsk. And we're going to uh, launch the harpoons really so that they, they flank the enemies. Roger. Our harpoons are more intelligent there. And maybe we'll be a bit more lucky with terrain. We'll Look see at that. Goes. Our ones are going over them. Which mode you fire it in? They have a harpoon. Have you guys spawned in or not? Negative, oh, yeah. I'm waiting. Negative. Same. Our harpoons have got past the trees and they're now on their way to the enemy wrestles. Okay, first guys are spawning up to take off, looks like damp and coke. We'll try and sneak in before them, see what happens. Well, we might not need to do anything, because these harpoons are nearly through. They're pretty three miles away. Nuclear Wessel. Tell me that's not a Kirov class. No, it's not. No, it's not. Tally, Chinese something or other. Legacy Vessels, 1996. We can spawn in now, right? Be able to try. I'm gonna try to spawn so I get also a waypoint set. Oh, I got shot down. Roger. Okay, the Delta models have failed. I mean, the S models have failed. Come on, baby, hit the nuclear vessel. He's gonna get through. Okay, I'm gonna in. get through. Okay, I'm gonna try coming in. Oh. 
video. Oh, nice. Oh, and he's down. I'm just watching the last harpoons go down, yo. It's a learning computer. Uh, if you have taken the new board, you'll see there's two red points that you can set. Can you get through? Can you get through? It's gonna get through and it's got a 200, 400 pound warhead. Hit. What happened? It just disappeared. Oh, what a crock. Hey, valid viewers. I am in Boggity Bog Bog. Uh, let's get ourselves some wet webs. Definitely don't want that lot. Um, I want... I haven't found I think I've fired one of these in anger yet. That should be awesome. Are we allowed to have nine exits? Because they didn't come out till after 96. I've got M's because the X's are, you know, OP. Roger. Are you guys taking T pod? Question mark? No, probably not. Uh, I've got Rule Eye, so I've got Data Link pod, I think it is. Rule Eye? Wow! The ball's on that man. I wasn't the X's enough today. Right, how about that? I don't dare do that. I'm just going for Harpoonians. We can my terrible idea. Yeah, I'm just going for harpoons and uh, 120s. Hmm? Harpoon D's or E's? Deltas. Harpoon Delta. Copy. Right, let's see if we can remember how to set a Boxton up, guys. Uh, it's been a... Um, um, i trying to remember all these planes. Get that. Uh, AIM-9 was... AIM-9X was developed in 96, apparently. But I suppose they weren't using it. Uh, don't want any of that. Uh, what have I forgotten? HMD. I'll take that. Need my beautiful panels. On. Don't have to do a head realignment. Rearming's complete. And speed chat's ready. Two ready. Go, guys. Uh, which side of the car are you? Are you in the front or in the back? I'm Cat 2. Cat 1. Roger, go for it. I'm going to go for Cat 3 in the back. Um, I'm right next to Cat 1, so shall I go for Cat 1? Yep, go for it. Copy. Hey you, hook my aeroplane up. That's an hors d'oeuvre. It's about to wait because their cat falls busy. Ah! Go to work, boys. Break them away, toys. What's up? Make sure you take off first, Chef. Yeah, actually the cat is busy already. So you guys are going to have to wait for me in the bottom. Uh, so two, you take it. Roger. Right, I need to actually concentrate. Wings are down, check. Flaps are half, check. What does that mean? What does that mean? Forwards, isn't it? Right, I remember. Zap. Come on, doody woody, what do you want? Right, that. Look at me remembering what to do and everything. Okay, super cap's going, guys. Right, I think it's uh, that. Is it that? Find out the hard way. We'll see you on hell. Yes, it is. 
watch something go wrong. Yeah, baby. Airborne, left orbit. And Christmas tree. Oh, that is lovely. Doesn't that look lovely? I love a good bit of spice. S sky, Valley viewers. Sky. Right, should we get these harpoony woonies fired up, guys? A lightning harpoons. Air to ground radar. On. Cool, up, left hand over. Just angels too. Couple. Oh, I want to shoot something so hard. One getting set on cap three. I'm gonna come buzz you because I'm a naughty young man. Look at those, the boys are off. I don't know who they are, but they're off somewhere, look. They do some good in the world, hopefully. Oh, better get my data link ready. Ich bin ein data link. this Falling leaf valley viewers. Well, not quite. Oh my god, I'm gonna crash, I'm gonna crash, I'm gonna crash. No. Ooh, that could have been ugly. Please Only down to 120 feet. Oh. I'm keeping uh, 290 knots right on button. Baby. Oh, actually want to turn my day link on. And I'm now downwind of the carrier on the right. Don't forget to turn your data links on, boys. One is on. Four is on. Yeah, three is already on. Is that all of us up, guys? Yep. Okay, Lee, please uh, do your thing. Let's go and bomb some ships. All right. I'm going to uh, pass right over the carrier in about 10 seconds. I'm sure we're going in the direction of our waypoint. So we're heading for waypoint one. Yes, we are. Target speed 360 knots. Or we get closer 
to wait him to shoot uh, at us sometimes, and then we can shoot fewer harpoon. So how do you guys want to do it? Saturation works for me, boys. we do is that we are going to locate that uh, destroyer and we'll fire from 30 nautical miles. We will fire two harpoons each. I think that should be enough to get through uh, the defenses and damage it uh, heavily. We'll assess them the damage and if, uh, well, if needed we finish him off and otherwise we can set up, set up a chainsaw. And so we shoot our remaining harpoons one at a time to the uh, other ships which shouldn't be able to shoot down the harpoon. Okay. What flight altitude are you giving your harpoon? Our target altitude is going to be Angels 20 and when we engage we're going to try to stay between 15 and 20. Okay. Uh, for now we are climbing to Angels 25 for the transit. speed I slow down to 250 burner burner cans Jumping tank. Ladies on speed. And dropping tank. Now. Super duper. That's an MR. Anyone know what an MR is? Uh, that's a Chinese destroyer, I think. Roger. Hostile air ahead. Seven uh, unknown range. Uh, that's maximum 35 range, unlimited altitude if it's the Yan Tai. Hostile air, 12 o'clock, 60 miles. Roger. We're gonna head the right 30 degrees, so we flank right now. Roger, hostile is on the nose, 50 miles, four times. We're gonna 
if they get uh, hot on us or if they engage our cap. And leveling off, heading 020. Six times enemy fighters. Search 30 miles. Engine zero. Three zero. Okay. Copy. Correction, I'm sorry, it's two zero miles, sir. What have you got your distractor? Coming to intercept us on my SA. Roger, do you have a distance? Well, 57. Roger, is that the one at 330? It's 334 at 55 now. Roger. Roger. Yeah, I think 
incoming for intercept. Okay, let's go air to air. Hit him right in the face, he doesn't even have an RWR. Fox 3, 4. Roger, okay, I'm gonna keep my uh, missile swung up. ETA 10 seconds, cap. Right, target, target acquired, I'm not sure why. Is that the enemy coming or is that one of us? Enemies calling, no splash so far. Missile lost, missile lost. Splash, by the look of it. He's dead. Yep. Carry on. Good Copy. Splash. It is. Splash. Okay, what headings should we go on? Okay, let's head uh, 315, head to ground. Tally ships. One tally 40 miles to the right. That might be the destroyer. Yep. Tally ships, should we go for the most right one? If I'm wrong, I'm going to engage the rightmost one first. Two ready to fire, waiting for orders. One ready to fire. Four ready. Okay, uh, we are too close, we are 30 miles. Oh no, we are, in, we are just on inbound meters. Okay, fire away. Too far away. One bruiser times two. Cap two away. Break right. Breaking right. On heading 135, what a pilot going on? One, can you confirm what heading you want to set? Uh, heading 135. Okay, two is uh, on autopilot and following the missiles in visually. They've got a while to go yet. Yeah. Airfirm, that's gonna take a while. For those that missed that, I think three has uh, left the survey, the game's crashed. Yeah, Are his missiles still there? No, I didn't find him if I died all that, didn't I? Remember, always fire the missiles before you crash. Oh guys, I got some good news. Looking like the Valanchar for AGM-84 is going also at the same time as the Harbour. Missiles have gone terminal. Got a spike as well. I think it's from the destroyer at Micromill. Gonna go 
go dumb. They're gonna go dumb. Why are they going dumb? Why are they going dumb? Okay, that's mine. These are mine. Mine are good. Mine are very good. Impact. 10 seconds. Roger. Come on, baby. You, sir, have been distracted. <laughs> Looks like saturation's gonna work. Sweet, I think came up. Impact, impact, impact. A midships one times hit. Nice, hopefully there's more than that coming. Give him some of your beloved boom boom. Really hot at ID. Oh, it's gonna miss. Miss. Look at that. Some of them are going stupid. Cap, can you confirm that the primary target was the one struck? Uh, it was the destroyer on the most of the on the right. Heading 300. Great, thanks. He's still alive because search radar still picking him up. Aerosol, should we strike the same target? I guess. Yeah, let's go for another round and then we'll return uh, to the carrier, rearm, and we'll go for another path of the others. Okay, so if you guys can uh, burn to catch up with me, so we try to uh, fire all the missiles Two. in a nice formation. Miles. Roger, turning in, we are 25, uh, 29. In formation. And fire. Bruiser times two. Blue cruiser times two. And break left. Four bruiser times two, breaking left. Nicely done. Speed is 
Can is 11X for the carrier. We used to come to Tacan. There's three with us. Copy, I'm uh, to your right and uh, Angel 22 on 25. Um, see a band in charge. I'm gonna level uh, the flight to Rod Angel 25. Uh, are you engaging or do you like me to handle it? Okay, let's set the pace up, guys. Okay, let's six. Hey, boys. Houston, seven. I think we, we can burn for a bit to get to the carrier. Roger. Okay. Burner in three, two, one, go. I'm 1.4 miles behind you both, but I'm not going to catch up as we're all on burners, just letting you know. It's fine. Alright, let's let's come up the burner slightly, slightly so you can catch up. And fuel, fuel flow 115. if you want to start putting your burners on. Roger, and burner back on in three, two, one, burn off. We just got hit, uh, we just got hit on the destroyer, 32%. Sixty-five percent, second hit. He's out of commission, I think. Excellent. I don't even know why my Mav Fs won't be uh, walking. Alright, code on the other basic designator and uh, Mav and is engaged. Altitude. Got it now. Rifle times Altitude. two. Rifle times is four. Splash is finished off. Three splash times two ships. Rescue's down and uh, the secondary ship down. Three is RTB. I have confirmation, Albatross destroyed. Hey! Nicely done. Shows what a bit of saturation can do. Oh, I got Samuel, Samuel Chase is destroyed. Nice. Excellent. He was an accident, I think. Ah. Yeah, I think one of the, the harpoons had continued. I either it was off, of course, or it continued and engaged something else. Okay.
Well, uh, M9, Captain. Just checking on your serial numbers, make sure they're in date. Having a spree of bad missiles at the moment. And then the uh, hot wounds, I think, mainly. Yep. Two's just going to blow off a little steam. I haven't told anyone about my fuel situation yet, but you know me, Pritch, I like a challenge. Two, what's your fuel state? Two is fuel state 2.7. Plenty. Fuel state? Fuel state, uh, bingo is set up whenever it runs out. Well, I've taken three because three's uh, crashed. Roger, I didn't hear your fuel state. Uh, fuel state is uh, 3.2 now. Roger. Okay, two, you'll be first to land, then three, and I will land last. Aye, aye. be able to get into the break a lot sooner than he will. Cap wants to put the top down. She can play that game. Maybe? Oh no, it doesn't want to do it. There we go. Bye bye! <laughs> Speed's going past his windshield at Mach 1.
ERC. Two L five. Copy. Aircrafts in the bottom. There's my hook down three. I'm uh, turning the right in three, two, one, back right. Altitude. Altitude. We're going to stay at uh, Angel 25. The direct storm of the airplanes in the pattern. Two. Angels 2.3, speed 3.5. And left hand pattern. As soon as you see a spot in the pattern, go for it. Aye, aye. Okay, gear down. I can do this before Cap's in here. Hooks down. Flaps down, put on the power. Flaps full. Yeah, I'd say if the tack ends down, probably the ILS as well. Just have to follow in the flaws. Ah, we're already on speed. Nope, we're above speed. On speed. A little slow, but we're going where we want to go. Oh yeah, this is beautiful. And a little slow still on speed. Keep it where it is. Keep it where it is. Don't, don't lose it. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. Full throttle. That is a four wire, I'll take it. Looks up. X screen. We'll break first. FM. Two braking. Then three, you'll be the next to break. 
Copy, we're going to a half mile. Three breaking. Roger. Two base. That is not standard operating procedure, Mr. Terrell. Two groove. Three going around again. Move that plane. Move that plane, Grump. I'm coming down. Sugar, I'm high. Slam it. Burner on. Let's go. Woo! You got it, baby. You got it. Clear. One second, B. Welcome back. Whoa! Whoa! No! Help, spaceship, help! Is that you, Cap? What do I do now? Why did I park there? Call that embarrassing. At best, this is problematic. At worst, it's worse. It's gonna be fine. Why do these things happen to me? Why can't they happen to one of the other boys? Just for one. Oh wait, it'll come back down. I took screenshots meanwhile. Better we capture rearming? I am, I think I am rearming, yes. I'm still filling up. Yep, I'm gonna fill up to 70%. That should be enough. Welcome back, Sandy. Is this Tomcat gonna go or what? About time. How long does it take to launch a god dang Tomcat? Here I come, baby, here I come! Yeah! I'm fine. And my harpoons are arming up. That's a lucky one. That's how you play DCS, boys. Yeah, but it's not a game, it's not a game! Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh! Reverse gear, please! Is that you? Oh, shit. How are you gonna get out? Uh, cap, spaceship, you have damage on your left gear. Roger, repairing. Cap, you, are you gonna go with that, uh, bad gear? I think so, yeah. It doesn't seem to be a massive problem. That's gonna be fine. Okay, I'm gonna get set on Cat 1. Out of the way, douchebags. I was going to say, what do we need landing gear for anyway, guys? Douchebags need landing gear. Go on, Grump Stallion. Your giant stallion. Guys, I'm still probably three minutes away from rearming and refueling. Roger. Roger.
Is this guy in two going or what? Maybe I'll do a cheeky little... Oh, he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Come on, let's get this done, boys. Right. Lass mich gerade gehen. One is pulling up. Don't make me amram your ass. Uh, one is launching. Oh, that's annoying. Ah, that'll be why. Uh oh, uh oh. Big 20 ton Tomcat coming down, boys. So, turn in the right. Come on. Take me. Take me. No, stop moving. We are young and we should go to um, Cat 2. Why is this so hard? All Got I want is a cat. Right. Why? What was that? What was that? Actually, I'm gonna go to Cat One and let the uh, Tomcats uh, want to figure themselves out. I bust my freaking, I bust my window and it's stuck half open. Why do stupid things always happen to me? There we go. What am I? What do you want me to do now? What am I supposed to do? Who would put Grim Reapers on that freaking boat? You! What do I pay you for? For Jesus H. Right, you know what? Valley viewers, I've been extremely patient with these douchebags. Have I not? We're going to do this the super cat way. Where well, we're going, we won't need roads. Ish, come again! Right, where's the thing I need? Don't hit that thing, don't hit that thing. Yeah, baby. F-18 all the way! My gear finally came out! My gear came out! Right, that's you taking off, Cap. Airborne, sir. Roger. That looked like a non-standard uh, launch. No, that's your eyes, Chef, that's your eyes. It was definitely SOP. I've got to make sure my weapons can fire standby. Sure. Yep, they can fire fine. Alright, let's head the Boeing 013. Two. Ooh, why is she not handling right? My wings are open, yes. Actually, 011. And starting the climb. My plane does not feel right at all. As you know, I don't know anything about anything, but... Let me know when you get close so I can increase the climb. Speed check. 310. Some minor aerodynamic problems going on here. So he's a mile behind you. Roger. By the way, I've got that problem with my uh, pitch pulling up, my joystick pulling up constantly right now. Uh, that's because flaps. you didn't put the flaps back on the uh, half for the takeoff. How guess. embarrassing for you, Sandy! Oh well. I'll well, just trim it out. Trim it out. That's what you should do with all of life's problems. Shows how sturdy these naval birds are, boys. Alright, let's go for another successful run, boys. Bags are for losers. We don't take bags where we're going. I really am draggy, aren't I? This is terrible. This is terrible, guys. Terrible. One little landing gear. So stupid. This is one, one of the many reasons why I can never be a real pilot. One of the many. At least I closed my canopy. Sound level, controls to five. I'm gonna go any slower, Chef. 
It was horrible. It feels like a wet sponge. Accelerate to 380. And actually what we can do is build a 10 to 12 mile separation between each of us. Doesn't sound very so much like then we will directly enter in the chainsaw. A fire of one or two harpoons each. I think we can try to fire twi uh, two at a time with a few degrees of uh, difference. So with a bit of luck they go with, uh, for different targets. Order. Ladies on the uh, So actually Cap, I'm gonna keep increasing my speed. Order. So then Cap getting trail. It's getting hot in here. So I hot. think we're, we're gonna take a more direct course this this time. Nope, I do want to though. I'm gonna start adjusting our course directly to the um, waypoint three. Two. To the firing point. So we've got a 20 mile search uh, setting. We will fire at three zero mile. And if we put like 11 to 12 mile separation, we should pick up pick all the target. Confirm 11 to 12 breadth or depth. 11 to 12 miles separation between each of us. As in wide. No, no, not wide. Behind. Copy. We we build the chainsaw. Copy. Look at that, my ATC is not working. ATC is literally not working. By the way, that um, autopilot thing did not fix the bug. Good luck with that. You're just going to have okay, to live I'm with that, Sandy. I am. It's good. It's good wrist practice. I can do I'm a bit of wrist practice. I'm our target. Bearing uh, 338. Cap's going to do a quick 360. Roger. Shook's do a 360 to the right. Supercap back on course behind you guys. Roger. And lead speed is uh, 420. Oh, I got one engine out. I've got one engine out. 50 miles. How embarrassing for me, Valley viewers. I'll explain why I'm slow. This is a problematic mission. Right, what's going on? What's going on? Come on. Yep, I've lost an engine. Right. Better not tell the boys. Better not tell the boys. They'll just complain. Sorry, Michael. This is terrible timing. Uh, is it the ship there on the very right we want to take, at the back and right? Yeah, good point. Uh, three, get offset to the right and attack the ships, uh, find... Yeah, and actually it might be just small ships uh, that are in, right in front. Okay, turning right. Sorry, one, can you uh, repeat? I'm offsetting to the right. And we are going to attack the ships that are first in the back. Copy. So we take down the biggest ships first. Ladies heading 035. Hmm. Well. Minor problems, Valley Viewers, minor problems. May have some problems catching up the boys. Still make plenty of speed. My fuel's not that bad, guys. Been in much worse positions. Cap 40 miles. Roger. Lead turning hot. Zap! That one there, boys. I'll take that one. It's got a target in the back. Two, ready to fire. 35 miles. Go for it. 
to Bruiser times lots. Shag. Why did that happen? I don't know why you're pissing around with all that bearing uh, stuff. Captain, did you fire at the targets in the back or in the front? Front. Four times missiles. Roger. So I'm gonna engage again the one in the back. I just need a bit more separation. Two Winchester. Oh, that's not flying right at all. That is not flying right at all. Right. Which way is it for home? That way, I think. Shooks is uh, 42 out. Uh, let me know when you want me to fire, special. Roger. Uh, you're cleared hot. Copy. Are you engaging the ones in the back or the front? Front. Roger. I keep eng engaging the back. Okay, Supercat missiles. Oh, why are you going down there? Why are you going down? Why? Big W! You're not supposed to do that! Oh, a very angry letter is going to be sent about this. Heading back. At least it went through the trees. Oh, I get so angry at these things. So, so angry. Three have blown up. One's got through the evil terrain. Man, why don't you just stay on course? Do me a favour, yeah? Come on, little baby. Confirmed one ship destroyed. Confirmed two ships destroyed. No! Well done. Confirm three ships destroyed. Wow. Nice, boys. I'm having a problem just getting through the friggin' forest. Just cross. Oh, why? Yes, we're through. We're through. Now sink a vessel. Sink a nuclear vessel. Not the speedboat. Anything but the speedboat. Not the speedboat. That is the speedboat. That is going to be the least efficient missile in the history. Why is it going? Big W! Y! Oh, I killed a Higgins boat! Well, that was a good use of a million pound effing missile. Killing a 5,000 pound boat. Jesus Christ! What's it doing? What's it doing? Yes! I believed in the big W all the time. I believed the big W. Oh. So unhappy about these things. Three of my missiles hit trees and the other one went completely stupid. Ooh, so angry. I'm so angry. God damn it, if I could open my canopy now I would. But it's frigging jammed! Oh! <laughs> Look at that! Ah, that'll liven things up. Friggin' super cruise with a wheel out, baby. Gotta check the old fuel. Bucket loads. Right, who knows where the carrier is? Guys, what's your RTB vector? Hello, 178. Thank you. Having a few minor Hornet problems. Minor. Can you see me up to your left on the SA? Are you uh, conning? Am I what, sorry? Doesn't matter. Yeah, I've got you up. See me home, boys. See me home. I'm 
hammering it. I'm at Mach 1.2. Do you want me to slow down so you can follow me? No, I got I got one engine stuck in afterburner and the other one stuck off afterburner. Nothing I can do about it. It's gonna be an interesting landing. Don't you worry, boys. We're getting much worse right, positions. Let's the car, yeah. I just lost the Taycan. Oh dear. I lost it as well. No more carrier? Question mark. It's probably still there. Just sometimes it just does that, right? It just goes off by itself. I did someone crash in the antenna. Oh, good <laughs> lord. Damn! 500 knots out of this S bucket. Not bad. Not bad, boys. We've had worse days. Calling carriers is for noobs. Just put your finger out and feel where the carrier is. Or use your radar. Use this one. How far is the carrier for you guys? I can't tell, but um, I, I'm going down to unstarted by descent. Um, I can actually see it on the F10 map now in zoom, so if you want to follow me, I'm at angles 18 and descent there. Oh yeah. Maybe I can get it. Yes! Yes! Fix my engine problem and my hotas was stuck. Or was it? Glad it was that easy to fix. You can probably follow the next guy in front of you. He might have eyes on. No, it's not. It's definitely not that. Something else has gone wrong. You know what? We'll work it out. Why aren't you working? Why? Tally on the carrier. I'm way too high descending. Ah! Wow, I see the problem. My left throttle stopped working completely. Well, that will explain a hell of a lot. So that one's working. That one's just not working, look. So how do I get it working again? No, literally not working. Right, so I literally do have an engine stuck on afterburner. This is actually a problem, guys. How do I get this engine off afterburner? Sugar. Quick, 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 quick! Help! Ah, I don't know what to do! Right, I've got... I put both throttles over to the right one. We have throttle! We have throttle! I mean, excellent wing-wing, but something's falling out of it, so I need to go and fix it. Right, what are we doing now? Right, solve my problem. Okay, where are we going, boys? Blow me sideways, I found the carrier by accident. <laughs> Paladin laugh, Paladin laugh. Chaff flare, chaff flare, chaff flare. Right, we've got to get the gear working now, guys. Old school carrier landing by uh, I. No ILS, no TACAC. Only a nerd would do that stuff anyway. Right, here we go. And with a dodgy joystick that doesn't want to let me descend. Right. What I'm curious about is cap landing with damaged gear. That's gonna be interesting. Roger, but I fixed right, my I engine. Wanna... I wanna be on the ground towards that. Feels sluggish like a wet sponge. Bollocks, Bolter, I don't know how that happened because it says I've arrived on the carrier.
Yeah, baby. Gear are coming down and ting. Gear are coming down and ting. We're broken, but you know what? We've been in much worse situations before, guys. Let's go land this baby. On the carrier. Yes, sir. Copy. I'll do another round. I'm not going to lie, I've had better approaches. But it's all right. Sorry, Grum. I had bad gear. Sorry about that, Grum. Sorry, Grum. Well, we did always say that Grump will uh, end up getting what he deserves. And that is literally what's happening. Really? Really? How embarrassing. Doctor. I'm going to debrief. Welcome back, valued viewers. No one bothered making an attack view file, so we don't know what happened. So, we'll guess. First group, send. We'll do it verbally. Okay, this is Damp Sock with Springfield. Um, I was, it seems like I was the only member of the Springfield flight. So, I ended up getting up in the air, uh, getting sight, getting scope on four times MiG-19s from about 60 miles away. Yeeted all four of my phoenixes at the same time. Got a nice little kill. Got some good footage with that. Uh, then ended up engaging four times SU-24s. Splashed one with guns. Got another with missiles. And ended up fighting a couple MiG-19s. I, I took a missile to the nose. But I was saved by some hornets. And I made it all the way home. Well done. Damn. Oh, I've got a tag for you. Oh, excellent. Send, please. Um, obi has got a 10 grand computer that ED bought for him, so he can he can do the tuck for you still. Oh, yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. 10 uh, grand, Jesus Christ. No, he's, he's, he's talking out of his bottom, I isn't would he? Never, I would never do that. Right, so what? while, while Obi sends the tuck for you, next group, send. Uh, it's not a huge amount to say, to be honest. We took off with uh, slams in an attempt to use those since the harpoons aren't quite working at the moment. Uh, fire them all off in the direction of the ships and uh, never got any feedback on the data link. So, uh -huh. so that was a bit of a bust. And I think Ali did try harpoons and they went off in some mysterious direction. So did I ask. Find out well, we actually did on the tank view. Mm. Trees, trees, they keep hitting trees. Yeah, a lot of yeah. them hitting trees, aren't they? Um, we then went back, we came back with Mavericks. My computer or my DCS crashed halfway through, so I didn't do any damage. However, I think Grump and Stoke sunk a couple of ships. Well done, boys. What with Mavericks? Wow, tiny little pissy little Took the tie Finished the TIE-52 off with a Maverick, actually. Wow. Fair enough. Grump, I can only apologise for the minor collision at the end. <laughs> I figured that was uh, normally what you do. Mm. Um, 
Right, okay guys, I think you sort of did a bit there. Uh, next group, send. Take your time. That's your group. Excellent. Um, chef, send. Uh, go ahead, Cap. I'm on final. Okay, um, the boys are still landing. I've run out of patience. So, we took off with 16 harpoons altogether. We fired 12 of them. Chopsticks had a... a we just... He had a crash or whatever, so he went out. 12 harpoons went in. Most of them just just went randomly and didn't bother tracking a few of them did track and we got two hits on the 052 type destroyer which is quite a bit of a beasted destroyer then we went back again i had a few minor problems with my bog and swear words may have been said they might not have been said and we went back for another strike 12 with 12 harpoons three of mine hit trees and the other one did an amazing 360 around the ship it was meant to hit and then hit the water definitely no w words were said uh i don't know about you guys did you guys get any hits with yours i certainly didn't with mine and uh, not on the second pass no i think they went a bit sec silly that time didn't they um never mind live and learn uh and then we got back and we all landed and we had a minor collision with grump by accident next group send okay uh Mikabo here um Took off in the area, dropped some bomb, got shot down by a MiG-19, and then walked home. That's all. Watch up. Um, okay, good. Well, bad, but good. Next group, send. Uh, the K-50s in Cobra Flight, uh, we got constantly harassed by MiGs, low flying MiGs. Uh, we all got shut down apart from Breeze, who went to work and destroyed a lot of tanks and stuff. Excellent work, guys. Next group send. Okay, Uzi. Um, we covered two areas. We initially were covering the uh, MI8 flights towards the Hawk site. Um, one of us went off. I think it was just one of us went off uh, to support the KA-50s, and I think he was one who saw most action. Uh, what was happening with us around the Hawk site was, by and large, before we got our missiles off, the local SAMs were taking down, down the incoming Reds. I got one missile off, I think, before uh, uh, the plane got blown up. Um, anyone want to say anything about what was happening at the beach end? Oh, yeah, uh, I headed out with Brinks, and uh, we tried to help out the K-50s. Uh, a couple of them got shut down, and uh, Brinks, I think, took down one MiG. And uh, on the way back, I took out another one. So that's all we could do. Wonder guys. Uh, next group, if there is one. Yeah, I think Texel's not here, so I don't know if... Oh, uh, dear, how embarrassing. Okay, please. the, the, the oh, MIH yeah. took uh, a total of six crates. Uh, well, they, first of all, they dropped the troops as they, as they were supposed to. They then picked up uh, six crates, uh, delivered five and a half of them. Uh, one was damaged. But having done so, then they didn't get uh, an option to actually spawn the Hawk site. So uh, all that work really came to nothing. Yeah, unfortunately, it was um, because the crate was damaged, it wouldn't allow it to spawn. It was only counting five crates there, so... Poor guys. Roger, guys. Just watching the attack view. Yeah, something ain't going right with those 84s, guys, I can tell you that. Right, um... Is it Reds next, or have I missed someone? No, you missed Enfield. Oh, oh, mm. uh, last and definitely least, uh, Enfield, send. <laughs> yeah, well, I suppose, yeah, a bit of a mission of two halves. So um, I think we, we added north, engaged um, the MiG-19s and SU-24s. I got eight. Penguin got Whoa. quite a few, and I don't know how many exactly. But six in the end. Six in the end, so... Yeah, not a bad 14 between us. Um, that was it. I was and then headed back, got chased back by a MiG-21 at Mac 2 mm -hmm. who um, chased me most of the way back to the carrier. Um, so I had to turn around and use my... Luckily, I had an A120 left, so that sorted that problem out. Mm -hmm. um, and then I spent 20 minutes trying to land on the carrier, being an absolute Oops. idiot. Um, completely failed, and then I just face planted it into this turn on the last attempt because i'd had enough oh, the embarrassment um yeah yeah it was it was shame 
to be honest. I just thought I'd finish okay. myself off. Don't worry, I'll make sure that goes in the film with plenty of comments. Sure, thank you. Yeah, uh, thank you. Anyone else? Uh, so that leaves us with the Reds, I believe. Well done, you guys, for shooting down on those MIGs. Reds, how did you get on today? It sounds like you've got a face full of Amrams and Ting. Yeah, I really appreciate it being shut down mm -hmm. three times. <laughs> Stoke, you did kill that thing with an A165. How about that? Impressive. I think someone might have done some of the damage for me there. Yes, we did. We did. I'll, I'll accept all well, of the I'll, responsibility. I'll steal that kill quite happily. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Very good, guys. Okay. Um, anyone to add anything to the whatever we're talking about? I think a red dollar for dollar still came out the victor here. <laughs> is that right right mm. well done guys jolly good fun i say jolly good even in a bog uh i'm gonna go and try and make you look good which is very hard and i'll see you um i don't know whenever monday sunday thursday or friday Tara for yeah, now just, just to say cap yeah thank you yeah. Just to say thank thanks to Bean for putting yeah. together a very, very good brief and putting the mission together for us. Yeah, as ever. Thanks, Bean. Thank you, 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 Bean.